love and brotherhood
Let me say that Uto Nobolo, we partner with Mbandia Obolo on anything that wants to kill Obolo, we will join you just as the prophet said and be the thing to football in the name of Jesus Christ. On that note, the international let me officially deliver to you the invitation letter of Uto Nobolo that is coming up next week. Obolo people will be gathering in Protocols next weekend again. One, and it came to pass in the month 20th year. Yes. Okay, so go to chapter 17. Then said I unto them, Ye see the ditch, distress that we are in, how Jerusalem lieth waste. How Jerusalem, if you put Obolo the there, how Obolo the lieth waste, and the gates thereof are burned down with fire. Then the next. He said, said, come, let us build up the wall of Obolo. So I am extending this invitation to Mbandia Obolo. Uto Obolo is saying, come, come, na, Jesus' name. Yeah. We arise and build. Tell somebody, I will arise. I will arise. Tell somebody, Obolo will arise. We arise. Obolo sons, arise. This is the time to arise and build Obolo land. This is the time to wake up from our slumber and repair the broken walls of Obolo. If we remain disunited, these important people, they will keep cheating us. Now, let me throw a very small challenge. Utolo Obolo, a few months ago, there was a terrible, uh, what is it called? What is that you call in Emeroke? Flood is the desert of Emeroke. And Utono Blu rose to the occasion, we rose to the state government and the local government and other government agencies. And we did not get a single response from the government of our private state. We are so ashamed of this government that a community like a that was submerged with water, an oil producing community in Eastern Bypass was submerged in water for two weeks and there was no response. But I give God the glory that through the effort of Utonobolo, today, if you go there, they are sharing relief materials. Obolo, arise. Obolo, arise. I hear that Eastern Obolo does not have a commissioner in this administration. Let me put a challenge to the governor of the state. I hope his representative is here. That Utonobolo will no more fold our hands and watch the government of our of state our people any longer. Uh, we are intellectual people, we will not take to arms, but we will take every reasonable step to make sure that Udom Emmanuel appoint an Eastern Obolo son or daughter into his cabinet. If he does not do that, by next the first quarter of next year, we will take the government of our of state to court. You cannot be taking our oil. You cannot develop a quiet of state with the oil of Eastern Obolo and Ibono. And yet, we don't have a permanent secretary from Eastern Obolo. We don't have a commissioner from Eastern Obolo. Enough is enough. Obolo people, arise. Obolo people, Obolo people, we must arise and build our Obolo land. In Jesus' name. Let me once again thank the leadership of Ubandia Obolo. And to say to you that we are here to partner with you. We are not afraid of anybody. Like Prof said, they don't have anything in their land. And they are benefiting so much. I was to drive to Okorite and there was no road. I drove to the governor's LGA. I saw fantastic road. Just after that village, there was no more road. That will not happen next year again. If that happened, we will mobilize all the of sons and daughters and we will block our of state government. You cannot take our oil and you will not develop our place. Enough is a... Thank you and God bless you. Put your hands together for the Admin General of Utoro Obolo. Put your hands together once again. Put your hands once again. Just like our brother have said, but are still living in diaspora till today. Enough is what? Enough. Thank you very much, our brother.
brothers, we are here. Me, I don't go to anywhere. I'm always ready. So just call me, put a call, or you, you flash. <laughs> I will put the call. I'm always waiting. He will be entertained as well for Bolo here. And then, um, also, recognizing the...
You can see when our uh, president was shouting at them, they keep quiet. We now, we are bringing the crop of RYC that can stand to speak, not those that will go to Abuja and eat. We call the name, yeah. We don't want to call them. If you stand on a position and you stand as a tree, you are not making a forest. But when your brother is around you, you make a forest. So it's high time when you stand in government, bring your brother close. I'm not the beginning of my position. I'm the youth leader of the Democratic Party in Andoni. But I'm not talking of party. I'm here for an Obulu. And I will speak as an Obulu. It's enough is enough. Agitating for commissionership. Commissioner cannot, the governor doesn't give the commissioner power. I cannot award any contract. We want those. When I drive, like the way we said, I drive from New York. I see the whole road, it's like, I say life is good. But when I come to our own, they bend it like this, so that I won't get accident. Enough of that insult. Enough of that insult. We will not take it anymore. We will tell the don't to bring that thing down to that place he plant the coconut. Let him not leave it in his own place. Take it down. And when I'm going, every, every word I said here, I will go and tell my boss. Because I'm the only to the president. And he said, I was supposed to be here. But they called him on Niger Delta Matter. So he stopped and asked me to come. Because of the law. And I pray by 2021, he will be here to speak. And by then, the, our message will go direct to him, Udo, so that he will know that this time we need an Ogunu man to be governor. We are not those that go to Abuja and not pay by the fees to speak. This time, the crop of Abuja boys and how I see we are going to go to the people that we go. That's why when I tell my boss, we go to Abuja side, the Andoni. We give on a local government education letter as a brother. But when we come, some of them I don't give. Because I don't come once, you know better. So, let's change from that one. Let's be our brother keeper. Wash my back, I wash your back. Injury to one should be injury for all. That's the one, that's the one we want to build now. Ignoring him, God will make him pass through another way and climb to where he's supposed to climb to. And when he climbs to that place, he will not see you like a brother again because he's trying to block him. Let all of us come together as one. And our appeal to the governor representative that they should change to Ibono Mobi. And not take it again. And I will also appeal to my brothers then. Go and learn skill. Go and learn skill so that when they need any skill, we have it here. Don't go and bring anybody. We have it here. Mobi, you need graduate, we have it here. So that they will not have any excuse to give us. But right now, as we are talking, my boss is making some arrangements. We are always, when we come up with that, at least many things will change. Thank you. And I thank you for that. Put your hands together for. Good evening, everybody. Good evening, Your Excellencies. Um, I tell you this way, hope my life. I am four point thirty latitude. Seven point three five east. Seven point thirty east longitude. I bet barrels to the core. Yet, I produce oil to oil. I am the contributor to your national economy. I am the translators of your dream. Yes, I contribute to your national economy. My oil wells produces wells. And yet, 
I am the marginalized ethnic. Yet, I don't know you get here, it's coming for you. Now, before the oil boom, my life on a steady move. Like the golden daffodils in the morning rise. And now the oil zoomed, leaving me in despairing doom. Like a merchant of doom, with lies of the television killing up the book. Hunger beats me now more than ever. Nutrition suffers like an unarmed man in the corrosive war of brutality. Yet, Aradizi, Kekila. Yet, Aranachi, Kelia, Ekamefuru. Out from this marginalization. Bring me out from this starvation. And bring me out of this paper recognition. Bring me back the hope of my game. Bring me back the hope of my future. Her voice must be heard. My voice must be heard. Your voice must be heard. The opponent nation must be heard. The Uto Obolo must be heard. Bring back the hope of our game. We do not deserve, we do not deserve crumbs. We deserve the best. Bring back the hope of our game. Keep our hope alive. Thank you. I think it is our standing ovation to accord that young girl a honor. We are 2020. Mr. Chairman,